people like the, um, um, what's his name? The so Ken. Sh yeah, is that you? Or? Yeah, that's me. That's me. Oh, thank you, brother. Listen, yeah, I got some big little kind of argument kind of thing, yeah. Yeah. I got, I got, I got a sister in that I've known for many, many years. Yeah. We had a debate because I said that the more, uh, like in regards to conversation wise. Yeah. Where I know somebody that can speak. 72 different languages. Yeah. In regards to bilingual, bilingual, bilingual and stuff. Yeah. And she said, prove it. So my argument was because I'm saying, well, I can't, uh, 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 I hate saying the word can't. Yeah. I'm saying, I'm trying to say to her, uh, I'll try to, 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 to prove it. Yeah. In regards. But now I can't, I, I say the word can't again. I am not able to find because my answer back to her is like, he's putting it in so many scrolls, over 1,000 scrolls that he's put out, man. Mm. Like, so, but what's the question? Like, if you ask me the question, then I can answer it. Right, so she's saying, she, like... She's saying you can't prove it, basically, right? Yeah, I can't prove that he's spoken. Right, like, so, like, yeah, so let me answer the question for you. Yeah. Is she a linguist? Not herself, no. Right, see... When somebody's not familiar with something or they're not like, like say, for example, you're an athlete, yeah? Someone who's not in that field won't really know how the people in that field would recognise somebody else. Like, if I'm a martial art artist and I compete with other martial art artists, then someone who's not a martial art artist is not going to really be able to speak and say what they want to say on the subject. So to answer the question, when I said is she a linguist, linguists are people that study languages. And when you study language, you will know that languages have a root. That's why even in English, people tell you Old English, Classical English, you know, like they will go back to the etymology of the word. And yeah. when you study languages, there's an easy answer for her because what you have to ask her is what's the first language on the planet? Because whatever the first language is or was will determine where other languages come from because there's always a root to everything. So when you ask people what was the first language on the planet, a lot of people can't answer that question because if they say they're religious, they're going to go to the Bible because they believe the Bible or the Quran or you know, the Talmud, all these yeah, books are yeah, from God. Yeah. So you say, well, what did God speak? What was God's language? And we have a book called First Language that shows you the origins of words and how they come about. And when oh, you go okay. to the oldest civilizations, they're going to be yeah. ancient Egypt. Some will say the Sumerians, but the Sumerians, right, they wrote what they call cuneiform. And that's that's what you see in the, in, you know, the ancient tablets, like, the Enuma Elish, the Gilgamesh epics, etc. Yeah. And the Egyptians, they wrote what people call hieroglyphics, which is the pictorial yeah. writings that you see on yeah. the walls. But yeah. both of those are actually scripts. They're not a spoken language. The spoken language would be known as Nuapic or Misbatia, yeah. which was the most oldest language on the planet. Yeah. So when you learn that language, you can see how all other languages come in. So for example, let me give you a few examples. So in English, somebody might use the word Michael. And you say, where does that come from? If you go to Arabic, they're going to go Mikael. You see, you go to the Sumerians, they're going to say Murdoch or Marduk. Yeah. And depending on what language you're talking, you're going to see that it will end up going back to the oldest back language. Yeah. 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 So like yeah. our men... Amin uh, in Arabic uh, will go back to Amun, you see, because Amun predates, yeah, predates the others. So if she's saying that, all you have to say is the person who speaks the first language on the planet will see how the other languages come from it. Because when you study the language, you can see the like um, the vowels because you have to then put the alphabet together and then the alphabet forms the words. Yeah. 100% I'm with you. I don't know. I agree with you 100, yeah. Mm. Her angle is, prove it. So she's asking me, yeah. like, find a video or something. 
Yeah. Well, um, well, the way you, I mean, if, if, if she was around, um, yeah. when we were like on Tamaray and when he was around walking, people went up to him and just spoke a language that they speak to him and then he starts conversing with them in that language. Yeah. Well, yeah. I'm trying to tell her that, my brother. I'm yeah. trying to say, it's impossible for me now, uh, say, for example, her name is Farah. Far, yeah. Her uh, pa uh, parents, if she's from Zimbabwe. Yeah. Mean, she, but she born and grow a beautiful being. But when we enter subject, because mm. so, so, she watched one of your recent ones with the, the um, can't remember the, the interview that you use having a debate, a di sharing dialogue with over mm. the table. Yeah. The, um, the Caucasian lady. Yeah. Oh, like, with the, the, kind of what you're, but, Her name's Cam, yeah. 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 yeah, so this, in the, this chick's point of view, yeah. From yeah. Her, yeah. I'm not trying to convert. I'm trying. I'm because I made. I made the point to her. I said, "Yo, the master teacher, like how you call there's an individual mm. that can speak, is able to speak seventy-two languages." Yeah. And her response is, "Oh, I'll stop talking crap." Can but there are people, other people that have spoken like nineteen um, languages. But the thing is, why? What, what difference does it make? Like, really, on the big scale of things, does she need, like? What difference does she make, whether he speaks 10, 20, 50 or 100 languages? Like, what does that prove to her? Or, like, what is the ultimate, what's she trying to say? Like, I think her ultimate approach is she always want to, like, she, once again, she's a, like, she's a, in, no, in regards to, she's an intelligent thing still, mm. in regards to that. But, like, when she, when she puts, poses things to me, it kind of, like, slows me down to, oh, oh, I have to prove this shit now. Okay. Kind of thing. What is and she? Is I she a religious person? To how to prove it back, to, like prove it to her, like answer it. Yeah. To basically, to, to shut her mouth up. In that sense, you know? <laughs> yeah, but but you're not the one that's saying you can speak all those languages. Now, what he has done is put out books. When you read his books, he's translating and showing you the languages. So, like, I'm saying, is she a religious person or not? No, she don't believe it in the word religion. Yeah. Yeah, but I'm oh, saying it sounds like you're trying to convert her or something. Like no, no, not at all. Which yeah. I told her that, by the way. Yeah. I'm not even because when she went like because we have I've known her for so many years, like yeah. over 34 years. So we talk about all kind of stuff. Yeah. But because me as an individual now, I want to get back into to be the student learning. This is my transition. This is my journey yeah. right now. Yeah, just learn. That's okay. all you got to do. Focus on learning. Because I'm gonna have to go because I got other people yeah, waiting. Mama. But the best thing is get the language scroll because yeah. we have a language yeah. scroll that shows the origins That's of. The name of the scroll itself. It, no, it's it's actually called um, Pa Lahaj, Lahaj or Lahaj, yeah, Shalel Wakut, which means the language of time, yeah. Pa Lahaj Shalel Wakut, that means the language of time, yeah. Beautiful. Um, and and that is basically. That, Online? Yeah, unfortunately, it's actually sold out. But if you can Google oh, and Zoom yeah. and Amazon yeah. and all of that, just try and try see if you can it. find it. Yeah, yeah. Um, just ask people. No problem, no yeah. problem. Um, do you do you attend the classes? Yeah, you know, I'm Spencer. I called you because I was after uh, after the school. Oh um, yeah, you were asking about. Two thousand, what to expect? Yeah. And then, I'm, uh, and then I want to actually get, and I actually also want to get the holy tablets. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You not, on, not online shit. I just want to have them in my hands. <laughs> yeah, I know. You want to get the physical one. But yeah, tell her to come to classes and ask her a question as well. Yeah, she can join on Zoom. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll try to. Yeah, yeah get her into <laughs> class. Anyway, my brother, thank you very much for your time. No problem. Anytime. One love. I shoot. Cool, All right. Cool. Peace.